welcome to Ari Jam 36 Entertainment News. I'm your host, Electra. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. In today's stories, Reggae Wednesdays to return to Emancipation Park. Noise Abatement Act. No more extensions. Itana happy with Irama nomination and Maka Diamond, officially the dance hall granny. Reggae Wednesdays return to Emancipation Park. Reggae Wednesdays, one of the signature events for Reggae Month, will return to Emancipation Park beginning tomorrow, February 5, and will feature an impressive lineup of popular artists, veterans, young and upcoming acts, celebrating all genres of Jamaican music. Reggae Wednesdays will begin at 7 p.m. with libation and drumming by Aquaba drummers. Jaria chairman Iwan Simpson emphasizes the importance of Jamaicans coming out to celebrate the music that has its origins here and impacts millions across the world. He shares Reggae Month celebrations are a gift to the people of Jamaica. And in as much as we welcome visitors to enjoy the myriad of offerings for the month, it is the spirit of the Jamaican people that will make Reggae Month 2020 special. Noise Abatement Act. No more extensions. There has been much noise about a possible extension of the Noise Abatement Act for Reggae Month, but that is not to be. Despite appeals from players within the music industry and positive reports of its effectiveness, the two-hour extension granted for the hosting of entertainment events has come to an end. This was reportedly disclosed by participants at a recent Gleaner Entertainment Forum on Reggae Month. Lanford Salmon, senior advisor of the Minister of Culture, Gender, Entertainment and Sport, informed and chairman of the Entertainment Advisory Board, Howard McIntosh, both stated that the January 31 cutoff date is final. Itana happy with the Irama nomination. Itana, who is nominated in the Best Female Vocalist category in this year's International Reggae and World Music Awards, Irama, is happy for her latest nomination. She hailed Irama, one of the longest standing reggae awards show in our art form, as a very good vehicle for the reggae industry. Itana is nominated alongside Leela Aiki, Coffee, and Queen Ifrika. The announcement was made at the event's media launch held at the Jamaica Pegasus Hotel in New Kingston on Tuesday evening. The awards ceremony slated for the AC Hotel by Marriott on March 29. Maka Diamond is officially the dance hall granny. So, Maka Diamond recently took on a new persona, that of a grandmother, and she made her official stage debut on the weekend. Maka has often been the target of trolls who bully her based on the fact that she is one of the older females repping for dance hall. Maka hit back with her granny persona. She said, After dropping so much tears, I've come to one conclusion. And I hope you all feel better now. I'll be dressing and looking like what you all say now. I look my age. All stage shows still I go get shell. Drop some fire for hashtag 2020 new look. Me look sweetie. On Saturday, granny made her debut. Yes. All about last night, first time performing in my new look in Portmore, Ken's Wildflower. Hashtag RJR Cross Country Invasion Launch. Got shell. That's our wrap up for today. Thank you for watching Jam 360 Entertainment News. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com.